Now, here's meteorologist Stephanie Waldron with your Storm Track 3 forecast. Well, good morning and happy Thursday. Check out this gorgeous sight behind me. Our Stevenson Skyview camera at Shalote Point just on fire this morning. Absolutely gorgeous picture. I'm going to take a step out actually. Just drink it in. Enjoy it. This is how we're starting our Thursday. Thursday is going to be an absolutely gorgeous day out there. Yesterday was beautiful too. A great day to head outside, grab some lunch, take the dogs for a walk. I did both of those things. Hopefully you did too because this nice weather is not here to stay. Currently your temperature is heading out the door. Low 60s here across the Cape Fear. Very, very nice, very comfortable, very not normal, very abnormal here for this time of year. Don't worry though for everyone missing that summer heat. It is on its way back. Currently our dew points also in the upper 50s and lower 60s. I've been talking about that all week long. Very, very nice dew points. Not a whole lot of moisture in the air, which is making things feel just very comfortable when you head out the door. Now, as we take a look at our pinpoint future cast forecast model, not a whole lot to talk about today. We're going to be seeing lots of sunshine, maybe a few afternoon clouds here or there, but overall just another great day. Our humidity levels, though, are slowly on the rise through today. So today is going to be just a little stickier than it was yesterday. Still, though, very comfortable, especially for this time of year. Now, as we head into those overnight hours, that moisture really really starts to pump in overnight lows tomorrow morning. Not going to be near as comfortable as they were this morning. We're going to be in the 70s, right around 70 degrees instead of those low to mid 60s like we are right now. And then as we head throughout your day tomorrow, chances for afternoon storms. That's going to be that moisture that's pumping in. Highs are going to be getting into those mid 80s, some scattered afternoon showers and storms. As far as severe weather goes, just not expecting that, but we could be seeing a quick downpour move through, dropping some heavy rain overnight Friday into Saturday. Things staying mainly dry, and then we've got that chance for showers and thunderstorms throughout the day on Saturday. Now, I don't think it's going to be a complete washout. You are going to be getting some breaks from the rain, but you're going to be adding a lot of rain to your rain gauges as well. So Saturday may not be the best day to head outside, and unfortunately, these rain chances are actually going to be continuing into the weekend. But let's take a look at your forecasted dew points. Here today, we're going to be getting into the mid-60s, so a little sticky out there, but not too terrible. This is slowly, though, creeping up to near 70 degrees as we head into those overnight hours. And then through tomorrow, we're going to be getting into those mid 70s. So just a lot of moisture in the air. Any energy that we have through, not going to take a lot for some storms to form. Very oppressive air is coming our way here for the weekend. Today, though, enjoy those dew points in the 60s. It's going to be the last day that we see those for a while. For your rest of your Thursday, temperatures are going to be in the mid to upper 80s. Sunny skies slowly creeping up on those humidity values. Your lows tonight falling down into the upper 60s and low 70s. And a look at your seven day forecast showing daily chances for rain as we head into the weekend with hot and humid temperatures.